here is example 27. A flow of 10.9 cubic meters per second is carried by a suppressed weir with crest 4.88 meters long. The depth of flow in the channel must not exceed 2.44 meters using a weir coefficient of 1.85 compute the following. The velocity of approach, the head on the weir, considering the velocity of approach and the height to which the crest should be placed. Remember that the coefficient of discharge of a weir must be less than 1. Because this is greater than 1, it means that it is the same as that of the Francis formula. Where in the Francis formula, the constant is 1.84. So for the velocity of approach, Q is cross-section of the channel, which is width of the channel times depth of flow times mean velocity or velocity of approach. So 10.9 equals, uh, because this is a suppressed weir, the length of the crest is also the width of the channel, then the depth of flow 2.44 meters in the channel times the velocity of approach. So the velocity of approach is 0.9154 meters per second. Then the head on the weir, considering the velocity of approach, so we use the formula Q equals 1.85 L quantity quantity H plus H sub V raised to 3 halves minus H sub V to the 3 halves. Remember when the velocity head of approach is considered, this was the formula. Then in Francis' formula, this is 1.84. So here it's 1.85 because it is given. So H sub V is velocity of approach square over 19.62 or 2G. So it is equal to 0 0.04271 meters. Substitute into this equation. So 10.9 equals 1.85 times 4.88 times the open quantity, quantity H plus 0 0.04271 raised to 3 halves minus 0 0.04271 raised to 3 halves. So 10.9 divided by quantity 1.85 times 4.88 equals then plus 0 0.04271 to the 3 halves. Then answer. Then the answer must be raised to 2 thirds. Then after that, subtract 0 0.04271. You will get H equals 1.097. Then for the height to which the crest should be placed, it's P, the, this height of the weir here. So P, this is the depth of flow. So the depth of flow, 2.44 equals P plus head. And we have already found the head. So 2.44 meters depth equals height to which the crest must be positioned, then plus head, 1.097. So the height of the weir is 1.343 meters.